Belleville woman wants action after suffering a serious leg injury at Mardi Gras over the weekend. Fox 2's Andy Banker shows us two days later the sidewalk hazard that caused her injury still isn't fixed. Dinesha Bonner says she had just gotten to Soulard. She was only steps into what she thought would be a day of great fun. And then she stepped into this. I don't have a good enough imagination to make it up. Denisha Bonner still can't walk. <laughs> She says out in the Mardi Gras crowd Saturday, 7th Street was packed and there was no sign of trouble ahead on the sidewalk outside the new Soho apartments. From here, that green spot hardly looks dangerous. And I took three more steps in. My leg was just in a hole. This hole, a drain pipe. It's supposed to be covered like this one about 20 yards away. All I could think was, I see the inside of my leg. I see my bone and my tendons and my ligaments and I see it. It's right there open. Yeah, it was very painful. She says doctors can't completely close the wound because of the amount of flesh she has lost. Her mother's helping her out now. Neither of them can understand how this can happen at such a large, well-planned event. Nearly 48 hours after Bonner's injury, the hole was still uncovered and she was still uncertain about her two jobs, part-time model and full-time financial services worker. I hope it doesn't change my life, but it does seem like it'd be life-changing. It's kind of scary because I can't walk on my leg. Your mind is to not bump into the people in front of you. You're not looking straight down. I just hope that they actually do something so nobody else get hurt. Like, what if a child gets hurt? We've gotten no response from the property manager or city authorities, but by early tonight, an orange safety cone was covering the hole. Andy Banker, Fox 2 News.